We welcome you to this Seder, and as we kindle these festival lights, we are grateful to be here with each other, sharing our lives together, humbly mindful of the gift of light and fire. lift this cup of wine in honor of the Israelites who suffered under the yoke of slavery and for demonstrating resilience in the face of bondage. This is the bread of affliction that our ancestors ate before they were free. Let us show unwavering love and kindness to all who are hungry and enslaved today. We set aside a broken piece of matzah that will become the afikomen to teach the value of perseverance, knowing that what seems broken may be repaired. The combination of matzah, maror, and charosa teaches us that life can be dry, sweet, and sometimes bitter. Yet when we rise to the challenge with bravery, we can accomplish great things. We now open the door for the prophet Elijah which symbolizes hope for a better world for all people. With a gesture of spiritual positivity, we honor our faith in a higher purpose and an interest in the unknowable and unseen. And now it's time to eat. The meal time is the perfect opportunity to express our feelings of neighborly love for everyone at the table as we share in this festive meal together and engage in positive conversations that enhance your Seder. The Torah teaches, and you shall love your neighbor as yourself. My name is Reese. I'm an Avenger Spodi, and I just wanted to wish everyone a happy Passover and sing you Die Anu. Die, Die Anu, Die, Die Anu, Die, Die Anu, Die Anu, Die Anu, Die Anu. Lilu Hotsi Hotsi Anu, Hotsi Anu, Me Mitzrayim, Hotsi Anu, Me Mitzrayim, Die Anu. Die, Die Anu, Die, Die Anu, Die, Die Anu, Die Anu, Die Anu, Die Anu. Your turn.